morning guys, what is up? The Rimba Red Race is going to happen this weekend, 5 days away. But before that, I want to run through with you the setup for my bike for the Rimba Red Race. So as you know, I'm participating in a Cat B category, which is a below 1000cc twin cylinder. Behind me is my machine lah. The KTM 790R. This is just for fun. I'm not a professional racer. <laughs> I just want to share with you what, what my setup is, um, the tires I'm using, um, or some other accessories I'm using. Lah. Uh, but before that, um, you know, the race is going to be 240 kilometers far, I guess. So it's 120 already cannot tahan. This one asked me to do 240. lah. <laughs> If you want to race a long distance race like this, you need a lot of nutrition, you know, for your body during the race. For example, you need your electrolytes, you need your salt, probably sugar, to replenish your body with energy. To do that, we are going to visit a company called Red Dot Running Company, which is based in Singapore. And they are the one who is supplying us with the nutrition we need for the race. So let's take a look at their shop, guys. We are Red Dot Running Company and we are here to actually um, get some nutrition for our race. See, one full basket of nutrition, man. Together guys, we have Miss Jerry who will explain more about uh, what the company offers uh, for you at least out there, right? Hi, um, I'm Jerry. This is Red Dot Running Company. Um, I started this five years ago because I couldn't find gear for myself. Um, I used to be a competitive triathlete and ultra runner um, in the past few years and so now we've um, grown to have a store that you know supplies nutrition and niche product. Um, we work very hard to make sure that we can stand behind all the products that we have. Um, we test everything, we try it out, we make sure it works before we sell it um, and we really enjoy just trying to help the community out and you know be the best athletes that you guys can be. Um, Red Dot Company is uh, supporting us with the nutrition for the upcoming Rimbari race guys. What do you think? This is a good benefit for, for athletes who have uh, proper nutrition during the race. It's very important guys. Yeah. Okay. okay. So we are racing about 240 kilometers on a big bike. Uh. So we do need this kind of uh, nutrition along with us during the race. Uh. Miss Jerry has explained to us a lot of benefits for having nutrition during um, the race, uh, which is, is very, very important. Uh. And we have a lot of products out here. So for you guys out there, please visit Red Dot Company at Sims 108 Sims Avenue and get your nutrition here. Yeah. There you go, guys. If you need any nutrition for the race or anything, maybe you want to go for a job cycling, uh, you want to go canoeing and you want to do any sports activities, you can always drop by at Red Dot Riding Company to get your nutrition, alright? You know, your tyres are a very important part of racing. So during the 240 km race, your tyres must be very good and it must have the capability to last that long and it must offer you the grip that you need to race or maybe to win. I don't know whether I win or not, lah, but I try my best. I've decided to choose Mitas for my race tires. Let's take a visit at the Banama Garage where they are the supplier of Mitas tires here in Singapore and also in Asia. Let's take a look guys. What is up guys? Today I am at Banama Garage at Kaki Bukit and we are here now at uh, Mitas shop. Yeah, take a look at that guys. I'm here to collect my race tire guys. Mitas! Alright! I think I try to find uh, the boss of Vitas. Uh, we chit chat with him for a while, okay? Yeah, let's go and find Mr. Khalid. Alright, here's Mr. Khalid, guys. How are you, Mr. Khalid? Hello, hi. Hi, hi everybody. He's the man of the match for today. Without him, uh, my race, I cannot make it. <laughs> okay, okay. I hope I have the uh, product for you. Okay, so yeah. we are here to collect uh, the tires that I've been wanting to use uh, for the race. Okay, let's go, man. Okay, I'll show you where the tires are. Alright. Yeah. So this is where the magic happens. Yeah. Ooh. So uh, we prepared the tires for you. There you go guys. Specially requested for these race tires. Actually I've been using this race tire for many years. Before Kobe also I used this setup. So now uh, Mitas is bringing in the new EF Terra 4. So today I'm going to try to use it for the race. Especially the front tire. You see it's a bit different. Huh? Yeah, this is the EF Terra 4 guys. Yeah. So I'm going to try this tire. Alright, we are proven in Red Bull, <laughs> Earthsport Rodeo. 
So oh. hopefully you'll perform in Wimba Bay. Yeah, so this is the EF07 which I'm going to be using for the rear tire. Better interview the boss, no? Uh, find out a bit more about him lah and meet us, okay? My name is Khaled Banama. I'm the owner of Banama Corp. Uh, we are the distributor of uh, Mitas for Asia, Singapore, Indonesia and Malaysia. And uh, we've been selling Mitas, uh, distributing Mitas since 2014, 2015. Now the range is uh, becoming wider. We're having more products and uh, hopefully we have good news. Um, maybe uh, middle of next year, we'll be in uh, Malaysia and also Indonesia. Yeah, so hope we can support all the guys who need Mita styles over there. From um, scooters, uh, mopeds, um, to sport bikes, touring bikes, um, even uh, Harley, Harley tires. And of course, our best range is the adventure bikes. Uh. Adventure bikes, motocross, enduro, that's where Mitas is strongest. And um, of course, we would like to work with partners, dealers all across the country to supply the tyres. Mm -hmm. um, in Singapore, you can get the right uh, Mitas tyres um, at our own place, HQ, in Kaki Bukit, Bali B Centre, or at all our dealers across the country. But having said that, um, for the motocross, uh, enduro tyres, um, most, uh, I mean, most likely you can only get it at our place. I only want to wish all the best to all the riders that participate in Wimba Ray. Uh, make sure you guys be safe um, and enjoy and uh, have lots of fun. I'm also a proud user for Mitas. I've been doing so for numbers of years. Uh, I think my friends who ride adventure bikes also have been using Mitas for many years. Lah. Since then, 2015-16, I started uh, using their tires. Ah. And it's a very good tires, like especially for um, adventure bikes. And I myself ride uh, enduro KTM 300. Lah. I also use Mitas tires because they offer a lot of grips. Lah. So I've been using them uh, for many years now. Lah. And we shall see more of Mitas in the future. Maybe uh, you know in Malaysia also. All right. So we, we wish him for all the best. Mr. Khaled. Thank you, Thank you so much. much. All right. So I'll see you guys at the Rimba Red soon. Okay. At the same time, your bike needs a good engine oil to run during the race. So for me, I've decided to choose Liqui Molly. Liqui Molly! People from Liqui Molly has uh, supported me during the race, uh, providing me with the, the needed engine oil, you know, uh, chain loops, uh, cleaning solution for the bike. I did not manage to visit Liqui Molly to show you around. I think uh, Felix is on a trip to Germany. Uh, but nevertheless, this is the oil that I've been using for the bike. And these are the oils that are using for Moto2 and Moto3, MotoGP guys. I've been using this for quite some time for most of my rides and my race. And the engine is going on very smoothly. Um, so if you guys want to try Liquid Molly out, do check them out, right? This is my machine that I'll be using for the Rimba Red Race, the KTM 780R which I bought in 2021. Firstly, I fixed the um, Rebel Exports Rally Kit. One thing good about this rally kit is that you can stuff your tools at the rally kit guys, it's very good. So for this rally kit, uh, it's very easy to uh, dismantle. With four uh, screws, you can take out the rally fairing at one go. Third screw and fourth screw. There you go. So during the race, uh, um, it's important for you to keep your spare tubes, uh, keep whatever tools you have. Uh. So with this rally kit, I'm able to keep the tools at the front part of the bike. There are two pouches that I've secured here using um, some strap ropes. This is where my front tubes are together with the tire iron here. And not forgetting, some um, cable ties, electrical tape here, some other tools that I've kept, tire gauge. On the right side, the rear tubes and some additional tire irons and the rear tire wrench. Here. So this one guys are very lightweight lah. So I put this in the pot. And from the front, uh, tow ropes tie downs whatsoever not okay guys take a look the portable air pump 12 volt uh, i keep in the rally kit uh, just behind the headlight Ouch. you see this rally kit uh, very good 
I buy this rally kit expensive guys but very good lah you can put a lot of things inside lah ok fix back very easy just mount the front rally kit secure all the 4 screws and there you go ok for rim bar rate you need to use navigation that's what um, the organizer have told us so I'm using a normal 8 inch tablet together with my handphone I don't have a sample here but I am going to roughly show you the mount uh, for it I'm just using a normal RAM ball mount lah. ok so my tablet basically is a navigation and uh, handphone lah, is a backup in case my tablet spoil at least I have an uh, extra set of navigation which is using for my phone lah, yeah? ok I've also kept some tools under the seat to save space lah. because the rally kit sometimes in front are not enough space so I'll keep I have kept some tools at the seat ah. Okay, let's take a look ah. Trail stand. This one important guys. If you get stuck in the jungle lah, you need this ah to actually lift up your front or rear wheel. Okay? Uh, check them out at uh, YouTube or any websites. They are called trail stand. Okay? This is very important. You have to keep this in your bike wherever you go trailing or racing in the jungle. So in addition, I have a spare tire iron. So total, I brought along uh, four tire irons. Uh, three lightweights and one is the heavyweight. This one is a bit hard. Okay, so four tire irons. Uh, if you encounter some puncture or what in the jungle, lah, uh, it's easy for you to peel out the tire. If two are uh, a bit difficult. So my experience, I always use four. Faster to take out the tire from the uh, rims, lah. Uh. Okay. Okay, for other tools, um, I'm using a rock ready engineering. Uh. This particular item already obsolete already. They are not producing it anymore. But uh, three years back, I managed to bought two of them. So it's a bar pad tools. Uh. Let me show you. Okay, guys, this is the rack rock ready engineering bar pad tools where some essential tools that are kept here. There. We have some cross, Phillips, flat, okay, some sockets, extension, uh, Allen key, star. So I'm also using stack packs. Uh, this is to hold my body uh, from going too far behind using my legs. It's going to reduce your arm pump. So your leg is doing most of the stopping and it's not your arm pulling the bike over so stack spec guys check it out and uh, I've just changed the um, chain I'm using uh, RK gold chain made in Japan ok RK gold chain guys take a look uh, for pocket size secret weapon cannot tell you no lah actually no need secret weapon lah in front stock 16 teeth behind I up for one teeth for the 60 because front when I use 15T uh, during the Sri Alam race um, the rear spin too fast and I can't control the bike uh, because it's in a muddy condition so I changed back uh, the front sprocket to 16T uh, so hopefully I can have a milder kind of response giving me more um, traction uh. alright ok guys side mirror also important you know racing uh, you need to look at the back of people not uh, but look at the front better lah but for me just a precaution me you may need it but I just uh, put it up uh, just a small side mirror at the side of the handlebar ok uh, this one bicycle side mirror guys searching for greatness in a sea of the dying and shameless uh, a sea of the aimless I don't wanna be one of the nameless I'ma wake up with the mindset that one day I'm gonna make it and I don't think I'll be fine if I don't break my limitations Don't try to stop me I exist to remember your story I'll make a decision if I want some peace Or if I want the glory yeah. Don't want a life that is complacent or possibly boring yeah. Just want a life that is worth every day exploring yeah. My whole life I just wanted someone who would notice me My whole life I just wanted Take a look at the raw jersey Raw Raw guys, raw. Race off-road adventure rally Singapore, and this is the rim barit. 
uh, special edition jersey that we've uh, made ah uh. how oh, nice not with the singapore flag rally guys i hope you enjoyed this video this is my setup for the rimba race uh, 2022 kuala tahan guys on the 23rd to 25th september coming this month uh, this year uh, and this weekend i wish all the riders uh, good luck uh, on their journey to kuala tahan this week take care guys and i'll see you soon all right peace out Woohoo.